Abby and this video is November's vlog. So I apologize right now, I'm still sick. I've been sick for like two weeks. Anyway, let's just get on with the vlog. So I'll first start with the bunnies. Here we have Storm and Misty, of course. Both of them are doing fine. I mean, they're not sick or anything. They're healthy and happy. And Misty has actually been binking a lot more lately, which I'm really glad of. And she has the funniest binkies because she's bigger. They're so like clumpy. <laughs> it's really funny looking. Storm's fairly normal. Ever since um, bonding these two, Storm has, I think he took it a little bit harder than I thought he would. But other than that, he's completely fine. I think over time, he'll, me and his bond will get better. He just seemed, I don't know. His bond with me just hasn't been the same. I'm sure over time we'll regrow it. But he's still, he's still Storm. He's still happy and yeah, but I just thought I'd tell you guys that. Um, also, I have a new hay rack, but I'm not gonna show you it. You're gonna have to wait till December's cage tour. And here's Misty in an upside down hidey house. They kinda like it better that way just because they can dig and chew it. There aren't really any updates for Misty, her coat is completely gray now, there is no brown. She and Storm are practically the same color. Her coat is getting better, it's nice and healthy now. Since when I got her, she's lost quite a bit of weight since I got her because she was really chubby because they fed her really bad. But yeah, Misty's doing fine and like I said, she's been binging more, which is really nice, I really like that. Also, I've been decorating their cage for Christmas. I'm not done yet. There's a lot on the outside that I'm not going to show you because it's going to be a surprise for December's cage tour. But right here I have the skin and, to skin and coat tablets that I got. And I got these specifically for Misty and... Oh, she's going to eat it. I gave her one like two days ago and she didn't eat it. Well, I guess she wasn't hungry then. You know they like it when they run. Also, I've already started to switch pellets. I have the organic ones in here and the regular ones in here. And I think once they're completely switched over, I'm gonna have like a comparison video to the organic and these. I just think it would be an interesting video to do. And also the treat ball has been a big hit. I know in the haul video it looked blue, but it's actually a dark purple. for this vlog is that I got a Canon DSLR. I'm so excited. I actually got it, I think it was the last week of October. So I've had it for quite a while now. I'm just gonna go over everything that I have here. So first of all, this is my bag or case for it. So this is a messenger style bag. I really like that style. As soon as I saw that kind of style, I really wanted it and basically I found this bag right away I was looking on B&H I first found they have the large size which is this one and they also have the compact size but the compact size was $35 and it was just a little bit too small for my camera and plus I wanted to be able to put other things in there and if I want to bring it somewhere, you know, to put my iPod and things like that in. So I went for the large size, and this was $40. It's too small for my laptop. It would be awesome if it could fit, like, my laptop in there, too. But I was going to buy it off B&H, but to get free shipping from B&H, you have to spend $50. And I just, I did not have anything else to buy, and I didn't want to spend $50. So I looked everywhere, and I found on Amazon, Ape Case themselves sold it on Amazon for $40 free shipping so I got it off there and I just love the colors it's gray and teal and it has some white buckles and I just love the colors and here's this shoulder strap it's nice and rounded and it's very cushiony I just love the way it sits and it's very adjustable as well so I'll just show you everything so starting off on the top there's this zipper pull and the insides are all bright yellow, which is supposed to be so then you can find and see stuff easier. So this is what it looks like inside. There's this place, which could be for like, 
I don't know, a tablet or whatever. There's some compartments. There's this big section and there's this zipper section. So in this zipper section, I just have this little piece of toilet paper just to wipe anything off the camera that I need to. In this pocket, I have the cord for the charger. And in this one, I have the charger. That's all that I have in there right now. And this will be where like, I put my iPod um, when I'm going on a trip or toss in some headphones. So now for the main compartment. So this opens up with very strong Velcro. It looks like this. And this has flap open and then it has this big zipper. And I love how it's like teal around it. It's so pretty. And this unzips and then it opens up like this. So in here it's big enough for your DSLR, a lens on your DSLR, and then an extra lens. I don't have an extra lens, so right here I just keep um whatever you call this, the extra caps that go on the camera body and the camera lens. And I also have a lens pen, which is just a cleaning item. And then right here is the DSLR. So I pull this out and I'll just show you the bag real quick. It has a lot of Velcro and stuff so that you can customize it however you would like. And this is to hold up the lens and it just fits really nice right there. So now on to the DSLR. I got the Canon Rebel T5i which I decided on the T5i instead of the T3i just because I really wanted the touch screen because I'm used to touch screens. I've been filming with my iPod for the past um, three months or four months or whatever. I really wanted this lens. This is a kit lens. It's the 18 to 135 millimeter STM lens and the STM stands for stabilization motor and the autofocus is so silent with this lens. I love it. I really wanted the STM for filming just because it's the autofocus is silent. I can't hear it at all. It zooms out to 135 millimeters, which is a decent amount. And I'm still getting used to DSLR video because it's a lot different. If you've ever gone from like a camcorder to one of these, it's a lot different to get used to all the focusing and just lighting and things. Yeah, and I just have the Canon strap. One of the next things I want to buy is a nicer strap because this thing is really a pain. And also, probably with Christmas money, I'm going to buy a mic because the mic, it's, I don't like it. It just doesn't sound nice to me. It's too hollowy. Like the iPod right now, it sounds a little bit hollowy, which sounds good, but this is just, um, too echoey and I just don't like it. So yeah, microphone is probably next on my list to buy and the memory card that I have is just a SanDisk Extreme 16 gigabyte memory card. And then to put it back in, I just slide it in sideways like that. It sits very nicely. I toss the strap right on top and then zip it up. And this is very easy to get to the camera while it's on you because it sits on your right side. You can easily grab it, pull the camera out without um, knocking over other stuff in the bag. So I really like this bag. Hey guys, so I would like to introduce you to my little sister's new female beta fish, Peach. So, she bought Peach with her own money because she wanted a pet, and a beta fish was the only thing she was allowed to get. So we got Peach a little bit ago, it was like probably three, four weeks by the time this is uploaded. Um, so yeah, it's a female beta fish, that's why it's a little bit smaller. I suggested the name Peach because, I don't know, it looks a little bit peachy. She's downstairs, that's why I'm doing a voiceover because it's too cold in my room for the little fish. It's actually in this wall shelf that we, we like, tore into the wall. It's not one of the exterior walls, it's an interior wall. And so yeah, it lives in a 2.5 gallon tank. And that's Peach, everybody. Okay, so now on to the shop update. So basically, I have some big updates. I'm showing you like my desk right now. I made an Etsy shop. The link will be down below. Um, I still have my store at Envy shop if you want to get orchard grass pellets. I also have some things like, like I only have one of these left, so that's on there because I don't want to have a listing on Etsy just for like one little thing. But I have apple sticks back in stock so I have 
six bundles and they're a pretty good size and there's 15 small apple sticks in the bundles and those are like four those are like four dollars each um a lot of you guys really wanted the apple sticks so i have those and i also have i'm also going to be putting on soon um larger apple sticks because i have a bunch of large ones from getting the small ones so those will be up there soon i also have three jumbo hay rollers which come stuffed with hay i stuff them before they go out so then the hay is nice and fresh so those are on those are on Etsy as well. Also another thing that I got are these bunny rings. I have gold and I have silver. They're not real silver and gold. They're just like a metal. But they're really lightweight and comfortable and they're like a little bunny. It's kind of hard to show. But yeah, now I have those. And I have like eight of each of those colors. So lastly on my Etsy I'm selling the, the Q toys. I still have um, three of the good ones here. Um, those three are on Etsy. These are on the store envy. I'm going to be selling the popsicles are on Etsy. I only have one left right now. I'm going to be making more soon. Um, this is on store envy, the bad one. Then this is on Etsy. The jingle roller is on Etsy. And then this thing is just on store envy. So it's easier if you just go there and check it out. Also, my secret Santa package is packed up and ready to go. I know I'm 95% sure that it's none of you guys. Um, or I'm, actually I'm 99% sure it's none of you guys. So I have that all ready to go even though I can't send it out for like another two weeks. So anyway guys, that's pretty much all I have for this vlog. If you enjoyed it, remember to leave a like and let me know if you've been liking these vlogs and if there's anything you would like to see in my next one. And also, I forgot to mention that um, this vlog is late because I was sick. Um, my voice sounded completely horrible one day. I sounded like a dying goose. But they're actually going to be later in the month from now on. I'm planning to do them like the second to last week or the last week. It's just easier for me that way. It's a nice like recap of the month. Yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and I'll be seeing you in my next one. Bye. The bond. However you say the word by tonical. Maybe. Hey. And this is basically. So this is basically Timothy Hay with um, chamomile, lavender, lemon balm and clover so this will be definitely a treat hay